everybody, Allison here from the Rochester Museum and Science Center. Just wanted to show you a quick home activity you can do if you're stuck home with your kids. You don't need a lot of, a lot of materials for this. A salad spinner, pull this out from your kitchen. Um, any washable paints, any colors you want will do. And then you just need some paper. Any color doesn't really matter, um, but you want to cut that in a circle so it fits right in the base of your salad spinner. You can put the piece of paper right in the bottom. And then with your paint, you want to put three to seven, maybe ten, depending on how much paint you have laying around, drops right in the center of your salad spinner. You want to put the paint right in the center because your salad spinner is going to work like a centrifuge. And as it spins, the force is going to push the paint to the side. And I'm going to add the paint right here. Perfect. Before you want to spin your salad spinner, put the lid on and just kind of tilt your, tilt your salad spinner around a little bit. Spread the paint out just a little bit. And then the fun part, right? You can just push your salad spinner maybe, maybe three times and watch it go. We're going to wait for that to finish spinning. What this is going to look like when it comes out is a nebula. A nebula is a large form of gas and dust that forms out when stars are dying, right? So in the universe, these nebulas, as stars die, let this gas and dust into the universe, and it's actually responsible for scattering elements in different pieces of, of matter. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna stop that, and you can pull out your finished product. That's Nebula Spin Art. I'm Allison here at the Rochester Museum and Science Center.